Joshy and welcome to another Road to Damascus episode. Today we are doing the, the uh, Org AUG, how we want to see. Uh, once again, i done too much progress on the camos, so I'm pretty much have to in custom games. This probably is making like a, you know, like a limited video of just doing like one camo challenge. So it's going to be the same with the Bison as well, it's going to be in a private match. And then hopefully it should be back to normal, so then how much progress I actually do with the uh, MP7, the Uzi and what's the other one called, the P90. So then the last three SMGs in any do, so it depends how much you know, progress I do on them. Hoping I don't go too mad, which I've been doing the last like three episodes by now. But it's all good. As long as I'm still getting closer to the map, I don't really mind. So then again, I kind of like this, but I, I like showing the, uh, the progress when we actually get the combos as well. But the problem is, I always uh, start recording too late, and I don't want to record really early, and I have like like 12 games because right now it's a mixture between like three and four games after eight From like a 30 minute video down to like a about eight minute video which that's like the highest i've done so far it's eight minutes i've had some like six minutes which you can check in the uh, playlist but you know by the time i actually edited those like three or four games down you know, it, it, it takes a lot of time to do fair. It does take time. Um, which is why I, I don't really want to do, like, start really early and have to, like, edit, like, eight games down. Because that's going to actually burn me out. Loki. It's going to burn me out. Because the highest I've done is I've edited three videos in one day. Like, for Damascus. And, like, they were, like, the uh, shotguns, I think it were. Or some sort of pistols. I can't remember which one it was. But literally, after each other, I was, I was burned out. Like, you know, I actually grinding the games up. Again, like, uh, the gun's gold, then going into Share Factory and actually edit it all down. It's a lot of effort. A lot of effort. Which is why I'm going to just try and, like, grind all the guns gold. And then eventually, when I've got free time, that's when like, I edit them down. Wow. That run that run Swear I had like an extra mag left or something. But I was completely scammed by the, the gun there. Well yeah. it is where it is. Uh, but yeah this was pretty much the um actual gun I was using. Police sh uh, shipment. Or shoot I was obviously have like a muzzle and then the um the name of this person. The monolithic, I want to say it's called. That with like the best um, ranged barrel, and then you know, a uh, sight, and then just a good tape, and then either a laser or a stop. What improves ADS speed. But, yeah. Wait, do I have scavenger in this class? I think I do, know. Yeah, okay, that's sweet. I just realised I have scavenger in this class. But, yeah. Uh, the next classes after the SMGs will be snipers and marching rifles. Then, eventually, um, it will be the melees. And it will probably be the largest last or anything. Often, it's when drop zone comes up next. And if you can back it out for shooting in the trail again. So it depends, you know. It'll probably be the melees first and then eventually the launchers would be like slowly coming out. Because then again, for some of the launchers, like either like the attacker kills and like the, the uh, defender kills. Which I was going to do them in shipment. 
but I'd rather just, you know, focus on the melee, get them done. And then when it does come to the actual launches, I can um, do the kills and just obviously shoot them. And then, once I've done like all the kills for them, I can just wait until drop zone comes out and then do like all the um, actual kill streaks. Because like, they'll be quite easy once drop zone comes out. Like I haven't done a, a uh, one launch yet on drop zone. Played one game of drop zone and got like five, um, five what's called aerial kill streaks. And I joined like halfway through the game, so I got like five UAVs all together. The RPG. So it wasn't really too bad. Five in one game, so let's say ten per four game. That's like what eight games, and then some the aerial kill streaks. Eventually, the ground killer streaks were also mixing with that as well. So, about within 20 games, you should easily have both launch you. And after that, from the, from the main weapons, the muskets, you might do the growl and the fennec and whatever. Or I might not. I'm not going to shoot it. I probably won't though. I do want to end up just playing a bit more COD. Like this grind isn't likely. I'd rather just play Warzone or whatever. Instead of grinding camos out. Because once I've got Damascus, I can actually just flex it, you know what I mean, in Warzone. Even though it's still got Chrome or whatever. From um, Obsidian, that's the one. Which is making a flex on me. But. Here's where it is. Oh. Okay, still quite poor. Actually, the mag on this you know. On hardcore, it's definitely not that bad. But core is when ammo gets absolutely burned through. That is mad. Instead of a um, slight of under shoot, I've had it. A mag on, personally. I would have had Right. Also, I'm, I'm just going to do one game instead of two games, like two 100 kill games, as I just do one of the two kill games. That'd be easy. So, I thought that's probably the best thing to do. I was thinking about doing a um, like best class setup for each gun. Because to be fair, my best ever video with like over 500 views is a Black Ops 4 best class setup. I was thinking of doing that, but then again, I was thinking it's quite late into the game. Like, pearl has got gold for the guns they use or whatever. So, I mean, for the next COD, if I end up buying it. I don't know about grand, like the actual, the highest camo in the game. But I definitely would probably have players just on um, like the best class soaps. Especially like, like in the beta, when like, you know, it's kind of point. You know, just give my thoughts on the best, the, uh, best classes to use. <laughs> And yeah, you have know, quite sweet. Hopefully, get another bang in the video of it. Hopefully, more than 500 views. That'll be the last. Uh, but yeah, after Damascus, I'm gonna finally record my GTA 5 series. Uh, I've shot like on my online, or GTA Online garages. I've been saying I was gonna record that for the last like three months. Like, I'm not gonna lie, three months I've been waiting to record this. Uh, apparently I've seen some um, videos saying that it might be um, cancelled this year like the, some of the DLC. Which could have just been you know, some, uh, uh, some or it could have been like new cars or whatever. Apparently it's been cancelled. But you know I don't really know if it has or not. It's only, it's only been um, what's the word like 
predicted. Just with like the whole coronavirus and whatever. But another console that was postponed is the one in the It'll probably be postponed until obviously everyone's working back on it. We know I don't work at Rockstar, you know, I don't know what's actually going on with the update. I was hoping for some new cars though, so I can grind out the uh, heist again. Just grind out missions. New sweet cars. Pull the uh, rest of my garages up. And there, I thought. Living large. So eventually after Damascus, it'll be GTA. And also, I'm going to record, uh, well, stream all four games of The Walking Dead. The Telltale series. Just because, I don't know, it's a game I just want to revisit. I've already played the uh, last series on my channel, but I want to go from series 1 to 4 again. Because those games are absolutely banging. And I haven't played it for like, what, 2 years? 3 years? I think it might have been 2 years actually, but it's all good. So everything's actually happening right now. I'm trying to find out as many um, camos as possible while shoot the rusty shoot the players out. And just take advantage of the um, shooting the kills and show us for the long shots. Which for snipers, it's gonna be pretty much shoot uh, shrouds left right and centre. Until the, the kills come and then obviously shoot me. But I am having fun actually using the uh, Marksman rifles. Like, they're actually surprising how you actually have to use. Like normally like when we go into a, a sniper match, like in custom games, we'd use like the AX-15, the HDR or whatever. Like we uh, actually banned uh, like the cars and whatever in custom games. Because like you, know, you can seriously do some damage. Because like we um, also change like the health modifier. Just pretty much one shot everything. A like, shot to the tall will kill you. And like yeah, it's a bit OP. So eventually we put the, the health back to normal and then we put the extra these only. But actually using max rifles in game is hardcore, it's just it's absolutely class like. As well as uh, I can actually start to unlock the new sniper as well. I'm actually happy about. I do want to use it. I've seen people saying it's, it's like really good, whatever. It really depends if I like it or not. Excuse me, reload. But yeah, just keep watching the, the channel. Like all these um, brand new series coming out, whatever. And yeah. Some good games to come out soon as well. Got one bolt nowhere. Scavenger. There we go. Yeah. Plenty of um, content to come. So, yeah. Gonna finish off this game with 17 more kills. Only two hours. Let's go for a 7 kill streak. I probably won't have a force actually do it though. Let's be honest, I'm going to run out bullets after like two more kills. No okay, that's shot them by me then. No scavenge packs on the floor. Kind of a scam. Oh, yes, where it is. Uh, there we go, get you doing it. Here we go. Okay, so guys, did enjoy this episode. Please do smash like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.